Hi, welcome back to the channel. So, sorry if, it, if I'm a bit puffy out of breath, and if it's windy. So it's Monday, the 30th of January, and I thought I'd pick up the camera um, just to vlog today. So, I am just walking to work so walking down my track um, and I thought I'd just vlog so so I got work till half nine then I'm going to Bangor I've got a scan at sorry man it's freezing today I've got a scan at ten past twelve um, my last scan I had, um, well if you know, and you've come across my power tank, I went to my number four, um, um, my last scan we had, they couldn't get some of the measurements, um, for whatever reason, well he or she was very wriggly, um, and they said it could be to do with that. I don't know. So, and also Kai is going to his friends after school. Um, he's having a play day um, as well. So, so I just want to pick the camera up today. Um, people are going to say, but where's Jack and Ellie? Jack and Ellie don't get on one bus now. They get on another bus. And, um, um, that pick him up from the door what well, is so much better um, especially with Ellie um, I think I might do a, just a catch up what video about Ellie um, Ellie's got her an operation in March um, for her eyes but I'll do like a little sit down video for that or I can put it in at the end of this video um, so um, that is one of the reasons the taxi picks them up um, uh, because she just her vision is completely gone and she struggles to walk down this lane. She holds my hand that tight, it's unbelievable. So, you know, so I'm feeling much better. If you saw my on my Instagram, I've got an Instagram page for telling them along. Uh, yesterday, the day before, I have not been well this pregnancy. I am 100 not 100%, I'm quite sure this baby is um, a girl, because I was like this with Ellie. If I might be wrong, sorry, I'm looking down because I'm on the category. Um, so, I don't know, but I've been really light, light-headed and my sugar level's got a bit down. So, um, we're just going to keep, feel a bit better today. So, I just thought I would start this vlog. Um, Jack and Kai are the head of the Um, so, that's really what I've got to say. Um, so I'll catch you through the day as we're going to Bangor just say that we're in the shops and we might have some breakfast though that I'll vlog a lot we do very weird I haven't vlogged since before Christmas so um so it's very weird I've done like sit down video but it's like vlog vlog and I thought you might like to see what we get up to today so hope you enjoy it and we'll catch you later hi we're in mcdonald's now we're just having breakfast so i'll show you what we've got so i've just picked up meal from work so so we've got hash browns double sausage egg mcmuffin for side i've got breakfast back um, a muffin onions juice and this side 
that's our breakfast, so we'll catch you later. Hi, um, we've been to Tesco, also I've been into... I've been to Matalan, so this is our Matalan on a retail parking banger. So I'll turn back around. Bought four things, so I think I might do a separate haul, like a mini haul. Try on haul. Um, a try on haul. Um, so they had 70% off um, some of the stuff. So I was quite pleased. Um, so I will do a separate haul. We just got a little bit of, not loads of shopping, have we? We're going to do um, shopping tomorrow afternoon before I go to work. Um, and I'll see, I don't know if I can haul it, I will, because I know Simon won't haul it, will you? No. So we'll just see. Um, I hope the same, <laughs> And so we're off now to the hospital. On my scan, um, so and it people keep looking at me weird because I've got no coat on, and it's really every like it's cold, but I'm red hot. And we went to the range, didn't we? It's absolutely yeah. rubbish, absolute, absolute rubbish. But you said they're closing down or something, aren't they? No, I said I've heard that they're not doing very well. Mm, so, it's like the prices are more expensive than home bargains than me and them. I'm like, I don't know if it's because we used to. Um, well, them when, prices. when you look at the sales prices and you're thinking that's a bit much. Mm. Sorry for sun's. It's just gone a bit sunny and bright. So, we'll catch you up when I come out of the hospital um, and let you know what's going on. So, um, that's it, right, I'll see you later. Hi, we've just come out of the hospital, haven't we? Yeah. Everything is fine with the baby, and I'm not going to say the official date, but it is the beginning of August. Um, we just want to keep that to ourselves, don't we? You've uh, moved them out of this. Yeah. So, um, I have about, let's say, nearly 14 weeks now, and I'm 13 yeah. and so many days. So, oh, sorry, nearly oh, double chin, lovely. Um, so, we just left. Everything is fine with the baby. They couldn't do the Down syndrome test and the other one. Um, or something, they just couldn't do it. Um, so, I was in and out, weren't we? I've just had some bloods done. You are still about the first week to scan. Oh, yes. Right, I, I've i had four ba um, three babies, and every time I, this is going to sound very sexist, and I don't mean to be like that, because I'm not that kind of, bump, I'm not that kind of person at all, you know what I mean, I look at it, everybody should be equal, and all that, but we had a male who's done my ultra scan, didn't we? And I've never had a male do an ultra scan on me, like with the with with having children. And he was really efficient, and he was professional and everything, were not he? So I know some people might find it a bit more a man, but I just wanted to say say that really it was quite nice wasn't he and he was well, it's not just um, pregnant ladies who they do ultrasounds no no so um i've had scans in there before of my kidneys and yeah. so we're going to go and get mr kai from his friends and then i've got work i would just like to go to just lie on the settee and chill but that's not going to happen um but, but tonight, I mean, so I will sit down and we'll just give you a little catch up with Ellie. Um, what's going on with Ellie? Um, that we will, won't we? Um, because so I was in the appointment, so he'll know, he'll tell you more details. So we will do that and I will catch you through the day um, as well. And I hope you like this little vlog. We haven't vlogged for ages, have we? No. So I'm finding it, it's just a bit different. Um, but good news and everything is unky dory so far with the baby, isn't it? Yep. 
So, and we our next stand will be at 20 weeks, and we will find out what we're having if it's a girl or a boy. Um, Jack and uh, Jack and Kai want it to be another Ellie. Yeah. Well, let me just point out you can never get another Ellie. <laughs> Ellie is very, um, new, what's the word? New, new, new? Unique. Unique, Ellie is. And everybody will, whoever meets her, will say the exactly same thing. So, but they meant they want another sister. So, I will catch you later. I have been back about an hour from work. And Simon has cooked the children in here because I didn't want anything heavy. Show you. So, they've got pie and mash. Snake pie. Mash. Sorry about the mess on the table. Say hello. 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 You had? Did you have a nice time at your your? No, no. Oh, hey. Kai, Kai, did you have a nice time at your friends? Yeah. Where did you go? Kai You had no state school, Jack. Yeah. And there's Ellie. So I just eating the dinner. I'm going to do me something now, so I just thought I'd quickly show you this. Hi, we've just put the kids to bed, and before I end the video, I thought I would do, we would do a little catch-up of what's happening with Ellie at the mini. Um, so, we we went, oh, you went, didn't you, of the second... Well, beginning of November. Beginning of November. If you are new, Ellie um, was born with... Um, Peter's anomaly. So they have to monitor her eyes. She has her, her pressures done every six months. So she went, and it wasn't very good news, was it? Um, she, her left eye, her vision had completely gone. gone. So they said to come back. Was it Jan in January? It was going to be December, but they put it. They cancelled it for whatever they cancelled the appointment so um then you went for the 11th 11th of january yeah it was just it was a week week the kids went back to school and it was a bit oh i don't know what's going to happen so i'll pass you to saw he'll tell you what happened then um well she was um Going to have uh, a cataract surgery on her left eye, and they're going to see if she needs it on her right eye at the same time while um, they can look while she's asleep. Yeah. So she's got to be in overnight, hasn't she? Yeah. We've had the date, so it's in um, the end of March. I'm not going to tell you the exact date. Um, so it's the end of March. Oh, and... Sorry. Um, it's the end of March. She's got to go in. She's got to go mm. another night, hasn't she? Yeah. Um, um, that I think it's just to make sure it's done properly, and like she's gonna have her pressures checked as well, because I did <laughs> said to Simon, um, she's very irritated, and that it was like a two two hours later after the appointment. Well, let's uh, well let's get it right. We left. At, I left to take her at five o'clock in the morning. We got there, and then this was, was it about one o'clock in the afternoon? Yeah, I think appointment was at 20 past 10, and then it was, they didn't see it, about half past 12, and yeah. they like, that's one of the reasons. If you yeah, see... Yes, that's why she's a bit annoyed. She's been stuck sitting down all day, and she doesn't like that. She likes running around. So she'll have this operation, she'll be in overnight, and um, she has to have... A minimum of a week off school. She can't touch her eyes. Um, she can't touch her eyes. Which would uh, be interesting. Yeah. I, I don't know if um, anybody... I, I might mention it on here. Well, Simon is going with her to have to stay with her overnight at the hospital. So, uh, because I will be at work and also with the children being at school. So... You've got to travel back with her in the car. Yep. So we we've asked um the disability nurse and she's contacting somebody. Um, I'm, not, I'm not exactly sure how I'm supposed to drive. Right. 
you know, all the way back from Liverpool to here. So that's, you know, it's over... Two and a half hours, I'd say. Two and a half, three hours, yeah. depending on the bridge. Um, uh, with Ellie in the back, most of it's along dual carriageway or motorway, where you can't pull over. How am I supposed to stop her touching her eyes? Well, if anybody's got any suggestions, that would be really good to know, because Ellie does. We, we'll give you... Wait, we'll give you an idea. Ellie, when she was three, wasn't she? She cut her chin open, didn't yeah. she? And she, they put stick. That we took her to the, tr- um, the minor injuries. Yeah, um, and they put butterfly stitches on. She took them out. They didn't make it. They didn't make it home. Um. So it would be nice if anybody they... has got special need children that have been sort of in the same situation of having an operation like that and then there's only one person who is driving and there's no one in the back if they could any suggestions because that would be really helpful wouldn't he yeah, they'll, she'll leave with a patch on but that won't make it five minutes down the road because she'll just take it off literally yeah. so um we're just a bit struggling aren't we i just don't know how it's gonna work yeah um so she'd have a week off, a minimum of a week of school off, wouldn't she? Yeah. And we are contacting, I think it's called First Cross, um, to see if we can rent um, a wheelchair because we feel like her, her balance and the mobility might be a bit all over the place yes. because of the, the, at least if we had a wheelchair, we could take her out just to get some fresh air for her and stuff. Because she won't want to be in the house for a week, at least. No. So that's what we're doing as well. Um, so that's really the update of Ellie, isn't it, really? Yeah. Um, and the boys are doing really well as well. So that's true. And then I'm pregnant. As well. Only a little bit. Yes. So I am... Um, I think it's 13 and three days pregnant or something they said at the hospital today. So, um, anything else you want to say? Not that I can say on camera. <laughs> so, I thought I would end the video just to say thank you for watching. If you like the video, could you give it a good thumbs up? Um, if you'd like to subscribe, press the subscribe button. It's totally free to subscribe. And if you do subscribe, um, if you press the notification, um, or we are a little bit behind with videos. I'm really sorry. We've had um some problems with the editing, haven't we? Um, we have to wipe the computer and start yeah, us again. So we've had, but uh, we've got rather a lot of data. Yeah. So that's why the videos, we've only sort of put one up a week, haven't yeah. we? But we are trying to get back in the swing of putting two up um, because it, Simon is doing the editing because it's wiped off my computer and we just don't know when I'm going to, it'll be able to get it back on there. Don't get much time for it. So um, that is why the videos are, and I haven't been 100% myself, you know why. So, um... That's why, if you're thinking the videos of it, but we're trying our best. That's all we can do. So, um, so if you like, so we'll catch you all on our next video, and I hope you enjoyed the vlog. Something a bit different. So we'll catch you here very soon. Bye. Bye.